Hey there UBC, I'm David Cohen and you're watching the UBC Weekly Show. A minor hockey coach who tripped two players after a game at UBC has been sentenced to 15 days in jail. Martin Tremblay's sentence for assault is harsher than the 30 days of house arrest the prosecution wanted because the judge wanted to take a strong stance against the abuse of children by adults. Tremblay tripped the two opposing players aged 10 and 13 in a handshake lineup after a championship game featuring his UBC Hornets last July. One received a broken wrist. Tremblay, who was already on probation for a different assault charge, will serve the sentence on weekends. He has been suspended indefinitely from his youth hockey league. BC Liberals are reducing some of the post-secondary cuts they're making this year, for now. The provincial government has opted to space $50 million worth of cuts over the course of three years instead of two. This year, $5 million is being cut from the $2 billion operating budget, a significant reduction from the initial $20 million cut the schools were bracing for. With a hotly contested provincial election this May, none of these numbers are set in stone. Many universities hope that more cash will come their way if the NDP are elected. However, the NDP are yet to release a platform that describes their plans for post-secondary funding. Being the best! All right, everybody, welcome back to Sports Friends Being the Best. Uh, the playoffs are somewhat near done edition. Well, women's hockey, their dream season is continuing. They have qualified for nationals and going to Canada's final. I would just like to give a big shout out to women's swimming. They pulled through first place in Calgary. And if you've been to Calgary, it's hard to do anything that's good there. To uh, women's volleyball. Women's Sixth volleyball. Street. Say that. And of course, we can't forget women's volleyball, who have won their sixth straight game no. to take the no. sixth no. straight <laughs> Canada West title. One, one, two, three, sports! That's all for this week. I'm David Cohen. Seriously, who trips a kid since 1918?